I finally found some. So I set out on a quest to capture all my finds onto video. With no big camera crews following me around, I am joined with my pinpointer and my little shovel. I will travel to the most active metal detecting sites where I will swing my metal detector from night until sundown. Raw, I go extreme. These are my metal detecting adventures. Nice day for nice. Uh, spit it out. Nice day for sailing. Look at all the people on the beach. Yeah. So, geez, I walked way down there on the other side up here and find nothing. I think maybe a junk earring, maybe. <laughs> Yeah, walk way over here and wipe out. I come through here and I'm like, sheesh. Don't tell me I'm gonna get skunked today and do the walk of shame, but no, I didn't. I found something. There was a lot of people at the time, so I couldn't do this the scoop thing, so I'm just gonna show you my hand. It's just a lot of people here. I don't know why I come during the day. I usually come at night. I actually came to try and find a few things. I had this guy ask me to find his ring. I've had three people ask me to find this stuff and no luck. So there he goes. So, right in that hole right down now. Man, my heart sank because it looked like gold. It is kind of goldy, but I think it's gold over silver. It's Pandora. Definitely Pandora. But I'm wondering if it's gold over silver. Ugh. Or gold. Pandora. Look it up. Beautiful ring, huh? Silver coin, we got a Mercury dime there. Sweet Mercury. Definitely a Mercury. Right there. Silver dime. Cool. Definitely ain't gonna get a date right now. And I probably won't clean up too good. Sea tarnish, pretty, pretty bad on silver. But yeah, it's another silver coin, I guess. <laughs> cool. Much today. A lot of people here. I just, I don't know. It's not one of those days. Not finding much. Oh. I have to find that mark. Oh, I'm gonna walk way down here. 
for nothing. Oh. I'm back over here. I got a few coins, but I can't see it. It's kind of dark. And I come through and I go back down over there in the water. Over there. Come on. Find a ring. It's pretty. But you should be a good one. But it's too dark to tell. A little too big. So tiny, but okay, good. Focus. Yeah. So I'll see if I can find something here. I'm gonna probably call it an early night. Found a ring, silver coin. Okay. Not doing too bad, I guess. But yeah, it's just one of those days. I think not much. Let's see what else I can find before I leave, though. It's gonna be some fireworks. Fireworks coming, so. I'm limited. I can't go over there. They blocked it off because of the fireworks. So and there's all kinds of people sitting down over there. So I'll stick around for a little bit. field today. A little bit of a change from being out at the ocean. Uh, you know, it's like midsummer. And today's not really a good beach day, so I figured I'd get out and do some schools behind schools and stuff like that while school's out. It's the best time to get behind there. Ain't nobody around. And I got myself a ring down there, but I was looking at it really quick and thinking it's not anything special. But it's cute. There's numeral numbers, I think, all the way around it. And there's like a stone or two here and there. You should roll it around, but I don't see no markings. And it looks like there's some flaking going on, so. Yeah. Oh well. Cute little ring. Ring is a ring. Which adds to my number of the year, but it's not a precious metal. That's okay. I'll give it to my granddaughter. <laughs> Yeah, under the pier. Look at all this. Oh. All kinds of people here. Look at the shells and stuff. Which you're not supposed to take the little shells. Leave it for the little hermit crabs. <laughs> That's what I was told. <laughs> Don't take the shells. But people do. And you shouldn't, because I've already picked up like a shell and it had a hermit crab in it. Those little shells have hermit crabs. Leave them alone. <laughs> anyway, I come through here, I get a hit. Oh, I got myself a barber dime. Definitely a barber dime. Triple dime. Probably get a date after I clean it better, but let me see what else I can pull out of here. I ain't gonna be here too long. A couple more hours and I'm out of here. Oh. Six. And this is like a Canadian, yeah. 
an 18 quarter, silver quarter I bet too. See, oh yeah, she's silver. I don't know if she's eight yet, but I'm sure there's one. Wow. And I think there's more in the hole actually. I thought I heard more in there. That's a silver quarter, I'm almost sure. In the vehicle. Cool. The V right there. V means five. Beautiful. Cool. Yeah. Looks like I came here for silver dimes and coins because they got a mark right there. Mercury dime. Right down in there. All the shells. Yeah, this place. It's about four feet of sand. You never used to see this. You used to walk up through here. All this has been exposed. Unbelievable. So, under all here, I'm finding all kinds of silver dimes and old coins and stuff. Whatever, I'll take it. Really, coming here to look for gold, but yeah, it's hard to resist coming down here and you get all kinds of old coins. So, I'm gonna keep trying under here. All over in there is like old pipes and like plumbing and stuff from the old pier that was here a long time ago that got destroyed. There's remnants of the old pier, even like old, like that broken pier, those broken pier beams are from the old pier from a long time ago. It used to be a long pier that went all the way down really far, double this. And then there was a big casino at the end. Huge casino at the end. I'll show a picture of it right after this, okay? I'll show a picture of what this place used to look like under here. Unbelievable, finding coins from back in the day. That's pretty cool. Uh, the oldest coin I found under here, I found it, I got at home is a seeded quarter. I found a seeded quarter and uh, a large scent from the early 1800s. Yeah. I think the large scent is probably the oldest one. 1825 is probably the oldest coin I found here so far, I believe. But yeah, awesome. I was actually looking for a ring. Some guy said he lost a ring out in there. I was looking for it. I, I can't find it, but I'll try again another day. Probably somebody already found it, I would imagine. Or I got drug out to see you on the other. So, going to the pier, and I figure I got a time to get out of there. It's like, uh, been there enough pull out a few coins, I'm good. So I want to come out here and find some rings. I get this hit, I'm thinking, it sounded just like a penny. Also a penny hit, I believe. Close. I mean, penny is usually around 60, 62. 58. <laughs> the ring. Oh, that's carbon. Sure. Cool. I'll take it. Heavy. I'm sure it's carbon steel or something like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's that color. Yeah, it's black. Looks like it's a steel ring. It's really heavy. It's cool. I'll take it. It'll probably hit me. Sure way. But. Take it. Cool, at least I found a ring today. Oh, I did find another ring, but I wasn't. Was it a good one? I can't remember. Jeez. No, it wasn't. No, no. I found a cheap ass one. Another one of those round rings I've been finding on that pier from that damn jewelry store above. Dropping all their shit rings. <laughs> 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 I got like probably 10 of them at home from this year. 